This war is f***ing outrageous, it's absurd, what are we doing? Anyone who's ever felt those emotions, who's been a brother, Iraq, Afghan, Vietnam, and thought like, what the f*** are we doing here? They're going to feel that in every single episode of this show. What did you think when the news was blowing up about Kabul? More than 2,300 Americans have been killed. We need to take this nation for less terrorism being bred in this region. I don't see us making any real f***ing change around here. Now concerns are growing that they could take the capital of Kabul. Uh, it became really obvious to us that we weren't really there to win. They killed a child who was two years old. Believe me, I have not seen a two-year-old Taliban member yet. And it just shows you how f***ed up things are over there. It's the fifth major attack in the last four weeks, killing dozens of people. Violence was always the answer. It's either us or them. I may feel this in my soul one day, but I don't give a f because all that matters is coming home alive. Hearts and Minds goes out the window when you see the guy shooting at you and then he puts his wife and kids in front of him. Hearts and Minds, Hearts and Minds, Hearts and Minds. How the f do you win the Hearts and Minds of people who have neither? Oh, it's their fault for bringing their kids to a battle. That's right. We actually had a board in our COC. You know, we kept a kill count. We made a decision that not only are we gonna shoot first, but we're gonna do so without fear of repercussion. That's how the military's built. You obey orders. When you reassimilate and then going right back to that same mindset, you can't flip the switch that quick. So I just decided to leave the switch on. I was ready to die. My method of coping was alcohol. You know, I'd collapsed both of my lungs, broke both of my arms, most of my teeth were gone. He shot dead in an insider attack, killed by one of the Afghan security members he came here to train. Tensions might be higher than normal with the ANA and ANP because some army staff sergeant just went out in town and killed 15 people. Like, nobody wants to see their, their friends get shot and blown up. Nobody wants to see, you know, little kids get blown up and get shot in the head. Nobody, you know what I mean? At the end of the day, nobody wants to see that. It's okay to talk about it. It's okay to feel the way that you're feeling. But also, at the same time, do something about it.